Hello everyone. In this example, we are going to see how to do a forward modeling with a custom mesh. Let's say you have a circle or a column that you want to study the cross section. For this, we have to make a mesh first. I am going to use GMesh. In the GMesh, I'm going to add a geometry, which would be a circle with a radius of one meter which would have a center at x and y of one just to eliminate the negative electrode positions and we're going to close this and hit Q to exit now we have to define a plane surface to be able to construct a mesh I'm going to select my boundary and press E. Now I can go to mesh and make a 2D mesh. This is a pretty coarse mesh. I am going to refine it a few times by splitting. I think it's good now. And then I'm going to save this as a mesh file which would be which you have to export actually, not save. And export this as a circle dot mesh. And also you have to select the mesh extension and save. Now, very important, recipe currently only supports the version 2 ASCII format. That's what you're going to select and OK. Now your mesh is created. The next step would be to define the electrode locations. You want all the electrode to go around your circle. For that I am going to define 16 electrodes. For now you can leave this as zero because this is not we're going to use and now we have 16 electrode locations. I am going to use a predefined locations for my electrodes on the circumference of that circle. Basically, each electrode would be 8 of pi away from the other one on a circle with radius of 1 meter. I'm going to copy this, go back to recipe, click on here and paste this. And I'm going to the mesh tab and instead of making any mesh I am going to use import custom mesh. Then I'm going to locate my file which would be the circle.mesh and open. As you can see automatically all the electrodes are around your circle with one meter radius. The next step is easy. You just have to define a anomaly. I'm gonna define an easy conductive anomaly. Close it by right click and give it a value of maybe 20 ohm meters. And go to the form model tab. You can select among the variety of available electrode uh, configurations. I'm going with the dipole dipole with 2% error and as always the pseudo section for such mesh is not very correct because it assumes electrodes are laid on a surface so we are going to ignore this and we can directly invert this but since this is a closed boundary circle mesh we have to go to the inversion setting into the advanced tab and uncheck crop below find region because this is not a surface problem and then we are going to invert this as you can see I was able to do a forward model with a custom mesh that I just built in GMesh. And I can clearly see 
to conduct the anomaly in the correct position. And in the post-processing, I can see the inversion went well. You can also contour this, and also you can save your data. Thank you very much for watching this.